I'm back. So I wanted to talk about my monthly insert in my main systems little pocket right here. So I use Astrology a month. I archive the books. It's my main planner. It never goes anywhere. But this is the brains of the operation because this allows me to future plan. Okay, so when I made this book last year, it's the Hobonichi book. It was an A5. It's like that thin little small book. I cut it down because I wanted to just shop my stash to make a book. Knowing that I had a few of these and they were like lost in the sauce and I didn't know where they were. <laughs> Horrible. So I had an insert from Roro Designs. R-H-O-R-O -O Designs. She always has great prices. And so I had Tomo River paper and I printed out the insert and it's on there as you could see see it's glued on to every single page this whole system works with the moterm standard companion tns the most and this thing allows me and i've had it for what three years now maybe i should go get the other one so you can see so these are my books <clears throat> i'm gonna grab the monthlies I don't know why my flash turned on so this is where I do a lot of homeschool so I'm gonna try <laughs> try to move it all out the way um so it's gonna be a lot of different things here so when I first started these are yearly trackers I started in this one and it was an undated one. Sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> and I want to say, yeah, it, it came in this size. And so I used it because I originally was in a B6 Slim when I started in my system. I used it to July. Then I was like, I'm going standard. So for 2020, they're two separate ones. So I used... I drew it out, right, for the remainder of the year. And then I was like, I'm going to do, like, notes and things. And it was just one of those small little, uh, what is it called? Paper Penguin Co. Yeah, her dot grid. And so it was a waste for all this paper. So I was like, okay, no more. Then 2021 came. And I used well, the one I'm using now in the new year. So they look like like this. And you can get them on Amazon, I'm sure. Ooh, I might have to use these in the new year. <laughs> so I went through and I did this. Now this is so essential to my planning. Because I'm able to put all, because I use monthly books, I'm able to put all of the things on my monthly and migrate it, I mean, uh, let it flow into the weekly, into the daily, I could rewrite stuff. So that's that, and then here goes 2022, right? So this is my current one. And I started putting the holidays, a calendar for the yearly, this is my whole system, I typed it out because people ask me a lot and it's easy, me, easy for me to refer to this yeah just drop it now it's cool um it's easy for me to refer to this i'm also going to put right here pretty planning so when i redo this list i'm going to add to that i've got my husband's gratitude as well um journaling is there and then i always do like lists that inspire me okay so sorry that's a tangent so real fast I love this cup but broke the handle so I decided to use it for pins so anyhow this is heavily 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 needed heavily just a part of my system um I do have yearlies that I have had for four years five years four years since 2018 they track my weight they track my sex they track stuff that has really really 
um, if I have any like major issues going on. Um, so the one that I'm using now, it's in my Stology book. I keep them in my Stology book from month to month. When I migrate, I mean, I'm sorry, when I archive 2022, it'll just go in here and then all of the monthly books will come back and go in its place, which is in here. I'm going to obviously need to put them in there. So these are all my books to date that I do. So this is September, October, November, December. We'll go here. Um, I might have to, you know, move out this one, put up this, you know, these books and then, you know, so on. Once this gets full, I'll put it in a huge container like, I don't know, one of those. And then, um, you know, archive them. They're for my kids. So I'm going to go back downstairs and talk about my other one. But this is here because these are curriculum things that I do with my daughter. This is the room that we are in for that. Like, I kind of moved a lot of my planning stuff out of the way to make room for homeschool. There's her desk. I put that right there because my cat likes to sit there. And I'm like, do not sit on her desk. And then I also have a board and all this. So that's homeschool. Let's go back downstairs. Okay. So in 2023, I will probably leave this blank because what I did in the following years, I all, I mean prior years, I always put like images down, but that doesn't necessarily match the decor when I open this up. So I'm gonna have to cut again the back. I'm gonna make sure I cut it correctly because I cut too much off and that little piece matters because <laughs> It's not like snug in there, if if you know what that if I know what I mean. Like I've got to keep a little, and it, it doesn't bother me, but I got to keep a little ollie clip when I slide it in here, so when I close it, you know, it's not flinging all over the place. It doesn't normally, but so here's 2023. I said leave this blank. <laughs> so I've got. Um, a yearly. I got this off the internet. I don't know. I'm gonna, I've got my 2023 holidays already. I don't know what I'm gonna put over here. Maybe my planning list, the one that I showed you. Um, and then, yeah, this I'm gonna try to use differently. I wanna track my kids' holidays, birthdays, when um, my son is off school, military, any vacation, maybe just color code it. Um, or I don't know write it in but I use these small little stickers that came from a sticker book and then now I've got my January through December so I put these right here because I might use well this is a cream paper this is white I don't know how I feel about that but the January I I did myself and I always do a Monday start I'm a Monday start gal um, in the back, these inserts are not for sale. Um, I've got homeschooling tracking. A friend just recently did these and well, she's been using hers, but, um, she let me have them and I went back and recorded all of our homeschool. This is how I'm going to track homeschool and it's, and it's great. It's great. So since I'm in here, I'm going to give myself a heart there. We are right here on Monday. Um, so I paste it in after December 2023. And I tab tabbed it homeschool. And then it'll take me towards the back, which are some blank pages. And in the blank pages, I always keep... I can't show you, but I keep my blood results. I take my... Um, my blood work every six months and I keep those I print them out from my portal and I keep them in the back so I could refer to them um yeah so that is it I love this I tab the bottom they are gonna go uh it's gonna go hand in hand so then when I want to do another like say January I don't know whatever theme color I'm in or whatever cover paper you know, because I do my paper, I cover it up. This, I never use the TN strap because I like 
using this pocket and the back pocket to just put my book in um, because they get they get pretty chunky and I don't like it on the um, flap. So I put it here. I'm actually enjoying my uh, apricot. I didn't think I was going to, but I am. I also got some ink on it. Wonderful, but whatever. Um, so yeah, when January comes and I put this in, you know, if I want to do like snow or whatever, I would just use like a little piece of washi and a paper clip and go to town on that. So obviously this is like Halloween and October and I have that cute little piece of vellum. It'll change in November or maybe I'll just keep it. And then obviously December is going to be all Christmassy, but that is my monthly notebook. Um, I hope I've answered your questions. If not, try to leave them down below and I'll try to answer them the best way I can. I will say this. If you plan on copying my system, tab for tab, I mean exactly, at least say where you got it from. Don't say, like, don't, don't not say, you know, this is my system. When you know you're taking my system, if that makes sense. So at least give me that. Like, this is not my, you don't even have to say my name. Just say, this is not my system. This is inspired by somebody else. But I really can't stand to see people filming YouTube videos. And I'm not going to name names. I'm just, if you watch this, you know who you are. It's not cool. Okay? So anyhow, and take from people. Let them inspire you. Tell, tell people they inspired you. Like, somebody else inspired this. Um, but yeah, I love my system. It's, it's been working for me for now, uh, going into the fourth year, things have changed some and I love, love, love my monthly books. I wouldn't know what to do without them. If I just needed a calendar, like if I just needed a system, it would be this, just take this because everything else can be developed out of this. Thanks for watching y'all.